Hello guys, my name is CryptoStorm and I'll be showing you five awesome tips, trips and glitches in Fallout 4 guys. So if we can hit three likes, that'd be amazing. And here's the number one. I guess this tip is like gonna be showing you how to get up walls quicker. And as you see from this video, I'm getting up walls pretty quick. Alright, so first thing you wanna do, you like you wanna get like any type of thing. I normally use a cafeteria cafeteria tray and then you wanna like hold it. So like as you see from here, I hold it. I'm gonna like, and then you lean, you wanna walk backwards while holding it. It'll push you up slowly, but it'll get you up to high space you wanna get to. This is mainly made for the sniping people, guys. So if you're sniping, this will definitely help you. Second tip. All right, this tip is gonna be showing you how to get um, materials without, like, you get equipment without actually using materials. So basically, you wanna click X on, for example, jet, and quickly go bottom to it, like hovers over it. As you see from the top left, it gets me meant at without using any materials. Guys, this is a very useful little um, thingy, my bobby jiggy, and it will help you a lot. As you see from the grenades as well, it works with that. So I'm gonna go baseball and slowly, quickly, fast, get to a cryonautic grenade, and it'll get me a, uh, yeah, yeah. So guys, that's the third tip, I believe. Third or second? I don't know yet, guys. All right, guys, we're hitting second tip, and here it is. All right, so this tip, it also works with armor, guys, so this tip will actually help with armor as well. All right, this tip, guys, is to show you on how to move objects without you moving your character. So this is pretty simple. All you need to do is hold X and move the object around. So if I, if, if I click this here, what I've got to do is hold X and I move it around just using my thumbstick, guys. Yeah, pretty simple. Alright, now guys, this is one of the tips, it's a location for a very overpowered weapon. So you want to go to Huber's Comics, it's literally not that far from uh, Sanctuary, I'm showing you on the radar. And it's just near Diamond City, just a bit of a uh, north-south from that like, Diamond City. Alright guys, so as you see, I'm literally checking it out, there's a lot of pre war money, it's a good place guys. And when you enter here, there's going to be some feral ghouls, and these are like these little zombie indirectated creature things. As I'm picking it, I'm terrible at pick looking guys, so don't watch up. And I'm like... Yeah, yeah. I like suck. Yeah, I suck. Alright, let's do that again. Let's try and pick it again. Pick it again. Pick it again. And oh, there you go, guys. And here is Gorgonax, Gorgonax Axe. As you see from here, it's pretty strong. Uh, it does 64 damage. It's good for it, and it can cause bleeding damage, guys. And um, if you go through uh, this door and you carry on going up the stairs, it'll show like a good area if you want to like, record. And if you cut through a dark alley, that's when it'll show you a little. Um, a little comics room and it has growing like the barbarian's outfit and everything as you can see from the cutscene guys so yeah it's got a few materials will help you with your base and yeah all right guys thank you for the video can we hit two likes and i'll see you in the video